Now today I'm gonna show you what is IMG patch tools I recently built and pushed in GitHub and XD developers from. Okay, first of all, let's see what is an OTA zip. In OTA zip, we have files to patch existing Android system installed in Android device. So, for example, if we want to see this OTA, I recently got it from Moto servers with my tools, Android 7.1.1 Nova. Uh, for Moto Z, which needs to be installed on this framework. Okay, let's see what is this. NPLS 25, it's Android 7.0. This OTA uh, will pass existing system partitions. So let's take a look on updated script of this OTA. Everything I opened here. This is the updated script. Okay. Here is the start to make change in patching system image. For patching system image, this OTA is using block image update. Block image update function. Block image update function is trying to update system partition using system updates, transfer system new data and system.patch. Okay. We used to have a SD80 to IMG tool, which is created by recognized developer of XDX. Uh, it's really, really good tool created by Python. This tool can only uh, create and actually extract D80 Android file to extension for raw image using transfer list and system new file this tool doesn't support OTA so I decided to take a look on AOSP recovery uh, this is AOSP recovery source code and got the important C files and source codes to make and simulating actually this function on PC and trying to uh, patch system partitions per system image on PC without using Android recovery or even touching the phone. So here uh, I got block image files and with some modifications I made this small tool to work. So let's see what is it doing in actual life. IMG patch tools. You only need to build it with simply make command. Okay, I built it before. You see, we have four binaries here apply patch, block image update, block image verify. And IMG diff. IMG diff is for debugging tool, don't touch it. But these three are simulating these functions on recovery. Block image update this. Uh, block image verify actually is block image update, but it's trying to only verify is this patch is this system partition or system which is patchable by patch.dat or not it's not touching and writing on system partition just verifying uh, if you want to verify I recommend to verify before patching and apply patch is for patching other partitions like boot partition emmc and files like bluetooth file uh, modern image firmware or other things you can see in 
OTA zip. Okay, let's start with verifying and updating this OTA image for my firmware. Okay, this OTA needs to be run on only on NPLS 2586-3012 firmware and I have downloaded this firmware from model servers this is it, Griffin same version it's system dot mg sparse chunks sparse chunks are uh, extracted to the system dot mg now cut it here, copy it here I want to start uh, verifying her. This verify tool needs system that I first system and where are we? System transfer list system new get system that. in transfer list you can see some lines here. Uh, this uh, expert described these lines. Opening the first line is a version of Android for is. Uh, for example, for is Android 7, and uh, you can study on it. It, it contains a command for patching system. So I want to first verify this. This may take a little long. I'll be back and pause this video. And you can see verified partition contents and update may be resumed. This is exactly what we are looking to. And now let's update the system.img. Well, uh, this may take a little bit longer, but we'll be back soon. Uh, yeah, it's working. Okay. Um, and down with error code zero zero means it's successfully built. And uh, here now, uh, also you can check the progress in progress.txt. Uh, I'm planning to make a progress bar on C codes later. Uh, this is system.img. I recently built some patterns and patched with my tools. Um, let's try it, find out. Is this correct? The patch system with its prop. Yep, that's Android 7.1 means it's correctly working tools. Hmm. Now uh, it's time to test, time to patch boot.amg and test the other binary which is apply patch function. Apply patch, put it in here and play the background song. What is apply patch? Apply patch using apply patch function is a little bit harder. You need to find out what's really. Uh, you need to find apply patch function in update script first. This is it. Apply patch for boot.img. With the patch, it's not here. 
I suppose of a patch that p in it this file and put it here patch that p okay fine that file is this root of mg target target is himself if you want to touch uh, this, this sort if you want to patch source file just keep you put the minus here targets SHA1 size init is J and patch file patch file is boot.mg.p this uh, apply patch function can be used to for multi page multi patch purposes so you can also add multiple inits ha and patch files after this so and here in this case boot.mg it's single patch let's uh, down with error code failed what Uh, okay, I'm oh, sorry. I need you need to make a cache file here, cache folder. Sorry, passing. Uh, sorry, my bad. I'll fix it in new version. Down circle zero. Okay, this really help. Put that MG is here. You can see. Let's modify any seven. <coughs> Let me extract it to find out what is it doing using MK boot. MK boot. Board OS version is 7.1.1. <laughs> you can also check out the such A1 sum of put IMG and set 0041. 0041. 0041. Ah, that's it. Target is H A1. Sum is this. You can continue patching this files, update your script here if you want, if you don't want, it's good. Be cool. Now we have a system dump of new released Android 7.0, 7.1.1 for Moto Z, system.mg, put.mg. Uh, you don't need to wait for Moto official site to release it nowadays. Okay. Uh, I guess everything's set out. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh,